One of the most common regulatory pitfalls in opening a new business is signage. All signage requires a permit from our planning and building department. There are more than 25 pages of regulations dealing with signage in our unified development ordinance. And as such, it's very important that before you order your signage, before you even design your signage, that you come and speak to someone at the planning department. In addition to the sign type, there are also regulations on the size, location, number, lighting, and materials of your signage. If you are hiring a professional sign company to create and install your signage, make sure that they've contacted the planning department and received a permit. Sign companies are typically knowledgeable about city ordinances and can assist you in this process as well. Your approvable signage may also be dictated by where your business is located. If you are located in a design review overlay district, such as the Central Business District, you will need the approval of the Community Appearance Board prior to erecting any signs. The Community Appearance Board is made up of volunteers appointed by City Council to make sure that all changes in the district preserve the beauty and historic integrity of the community. The board meets every two weeks and works hard to make sure that your project is reviewed quickly and fairly. There are many types of signs that are not permitted in the city. No signs are permitted in the right-of-way along the roadways. Most temporary signs are similarly prohibited. Before you go to the expense of buying signs or putting signs up, please contact the planning department to make sure that what you are proposing is allowed.